business casual outfit of the day. Alright, we've arrived in California. I'm gonna be vlogging this quick weekend trip with Pacific Dental Services, doing a CAD CAM workshop that they invited me to. So the hotel looks super nice. Let's check out the room. Wowza. This is way too nice for one me. A big king bed. Let's see if there's other lights I can turn on. I'm so excited to get in bed. It is 10 here, which is 1.11 at home. So very tired coming from Michigan, but beautiful room here at this homestead Hilton. So I am going to get into bed and tomorrow morning when I'm getting ready for the day I'll let you all know our itinerary, how I got invited on this trip and what it's all about and then I will show you what we're up to tomorrow Saturday. That's the main programming day and then they are flying us home on Sunday morning. So we're really just here for a handful of hours for their programming tomorrow, but they did fly us here today. We left Detroit around 4 p.m. Eastern time and just got here after eight hours of travel. And then we will be leaving around 8.30 a.m. California time to get back at 7 p.m. on Sunday Eastern time. Lots of travel, but well worth it. I'm excited for the opportunity to be here. Good morning. It is Saturday today. I just finished getting ready. I'll show you all my business casual outfit of the day. But you can see the top better. So I'm just wearing this burgundy top, these plaid pants, and this little comfy slide-on shoe that I got at TJ Maxx from Dr. Scholl's brand. So hopefully it's comfy. I haven't worn them yet. Thought I would show you the cute swag bag they gave us. So there's this coffee thermos. And then inside, Pacific Dental gave us one of their little branded masks and water bottle, pen and chapstick, and then a bunch of snacks. So I have my own tote that I always use by the brand Longchamp. My sister gave it to me in high school actually. So I'm probably just gonna tuck some of these items into here that way I can still have a nice bag to carry since I brought it. I'm gonna quickly talk through the agenda with you all. I just have it pulled up on my phone from the email that they sent us, and then I'm gonna head into the lobby. I'm staying on the first floor, which is very convenient for no elevators. So I'm head to the lobby for breakfast once I finish reading this off to you all, but we got here Friday, like I said, so it was just a travel day for all of the students here. I'm not totally sure how many dental students are here. My roommate and I were invited, I believe because of our previous roles working with Pacific Dental through our ASDA chapter at Michigan. She was the lunch and learn coordinator last year, which is my position this year, so I've been working with Pacific Dental to set up some events at the school, and now she's the president, so I believe that's how they were aware of us as students and invited us because she's not like a dental Instagram person or anything like that. So I don't think they're picking like influencer type people, if you will. However, I am excited because a couple dental students that I have been following and chatting with on Instagram over the past two years are also here. So I'm excited to meet them in person because I never have because they go to dental schools all around the country. So there's two people, um, at the dental school mom, Kate, and then at the Lily Smile are supposed to be here this weekend. And we will see who else is here. The front desk told us that a lot of students are here for this event. So I'm sure I'll get a better feel when I go over to breakfast and especially when I'm at the event. I'm not sure how much I'll physically pick up the camera and update you all, but I'll definitely get clips throughout and then I will update you all when we finish before we go off on our own. But I'll read the schedule now so you know what you can look forward to the rest of today, Saturday. It's 8.30 right now. I woke up around seven naturally. I was gonna get up at eight, but because of the three hour time difference, it felt like 10 a.m. and I never sleep past like 9 a.m. Got ready eventually and now it is 8.30. And breakfast is provided at the hotel from seven to 10, but we have to leave by 9.30. 
So they have a shuttle that took us from the airport here and it's also going to take us to the Pacific Dental Services National Support Center is what it's called. The shuttle leaves at 9.30 and our programming starts at 10. So from 10 to 2.30, we are having a CAD CAM boot camp. So that is the reason that they invited us here is for a CAD CAM boot camp to enhance our skills a little bit. CAD CAM is like the digital teeth scanning that I've shown in some videos and Instagram posts and everything. So I'm interested to see what software they're going to be sharing with us or if it's a range of different softwares we get to try out because at our dental school we use the Prime Scan machine and Seric milling software so I'm interested to see what all they have to show us and we don't really do anything with digital treatment planning so in the undergrad clinic, which is the D D3s, D4s, we don't do much for like surgical guides or anything of that sort or like CBTC scanning. So I don't know if that applies to CAD CAM. So I'm not really sure what specifics we're gonna learn, which is good because that means I have a lot to learn. So I'm looking forward to it. And so that is 10 to 2.30. And then at 2.30-ish, there's a shuttle that's gonna take us to the lunch that they're providing us which is at a restaurant called North Italia, which is great because I love me some pasta. And the lunch is two to five, which is gonna feel late for me. That'll probably feel more like a dinner. And then we take the shuttle from the restaurant back to the hotel and are free for the evening until, like I said, our flight for me and my roommate leaves around 8 a.m. tomorrow, so we'll be up early. So if you're from Irvine, Laguna, Orange County area, let me know if we're making the right choice, whatever we end up doing. So that's kind of the plan is once all the programming and the lunch is finished, come back here, change into a little bit comfier, less business casual outfits, and then Uber for the evening, and then come back, go to bed, make sure we're all packed and ready to go to the airport in the morning. So I'm gonna head to breakfast, and then I will show you as much as I can the rest of the day with the CAD CAM bootcamp.
this is like a lot darker so you can see where it's orange but we have diff different hues of yellow I would say this is the one I use the most right here it's just more of like an almond -y brown more of like a yellowish one but like one right here and then you mix them up Back at the hotel, I just changed into a different shirt, then I have a blazer, and I will stay in the same pants. To go out for the evening, we're going out with the two dentists that were teaching us today. Um, two dental students from Nebraska and two dental students from Detroit Mercy that we met here, as well as, I think, one that goes to the Dental College of Georgia. I don't know who else from our group is joining. I think the dental students from Case Western as well, but we'll see when we get there. Half of the group is going to downtown LA, which is about an hour and a half drive with traffic from here in a $200 Uber or like 150 cab. So even split, it would have been okay, but knowing that I don't stay out very late, I figured I don't want to be stuck there and have to pay that full price coming home alone. So I think this is a better bet. We're just gonna go to Newport Beach, which is about a 15, 20 minute drive from here. So much more reasonable. We're just gonna go to a couple bar restaurants there and then come back. It's almost 6 p.m. right now, so we just got back a little bit ago, changed, charging up our phones and things, and then we're gonna call a cab. Hopefully it'll be a nice time. The dinner was great. I meant to grab my camera and have everyone say hi, but I kind of, was caught up in all the conversation. It was so nice getting to know the dentist better. One was a grad of Iowa in 2018 and one graduated from NYU in 2017. The 2017 grad is an associate at their most successful Pacific Dental practice of 850, so that's really saying something. And then the other dentist just started her ownership last January. Both young successful women dentists it's been awesome getting to know them and it really hasn't been pitchy at all about pds they haven't been trying to like recruit us per se it was like super educational we have the prime scan which is the machines that they were demoing over the projector and then we were using the omnicam so kind of similar to what i do at school we have both of those machines in our school the omnicam in sim lab and then the prime scan in clinics i'm familiar with both but honestly, they went so much more in depth with the crown design aspect. So like raising and taking away and smoothing out the material and like what you're looking for with the colorings of how much it's contacting that I feel like I learned so much more about crown design and a lot more about Emacs crowns specifically. So even though I had a little bit of familiarity, as I told you all, I feel like I learned so much. It's been amazing. I will try to get some clips the rest of the evening. That is everything I have to share for this video though. Leaving bright and early around 6.30 a.m. tomorrow. So I'm just gonna end off the video tonight. Be sure to follow the two dentists that we're leading our education today. They are super awesome and they post a lot of educational content as well as my own Instagram. And if you wanna follow my roommate, Anna, she just started a dental Instagram page as well. So you can check out her page. I'll put all of the ads on the screen so that they're easy for you to get to. Make sure, of course, Follow me, subscribe to my channel to follow along on my dental school journey, any more cool opportunities like this, and just day-to-day -day dental school life. I try to be very transparent with you all, and this has been an incredible experience. So, I will see you all in the next video.